everybody, Ran here, Sports Sedan TV, Sports Sedans with Ran. So I wanted to talk about Sports Sedans in garages. Uh, I was chatting to some of the guys at Nationals and Vic, um, the Victorian Club worked out there's between 30 and 50 cars currently sitting in garages, not running. Now, don't have to tell me about budgets. We run on a fairly strict budget, so I'm sure there's a lot of the cars that are in garages at the moment um, in different states of, of uh, uh, repair or build um, that have stopped due to budgets, um, you know, and that, that is what it is. And, um, yeah, I suppose what I want to say to everyone that has a sports sedan that's in their garage either ready to go or maybe it's just a chassis or maybe it's halfway through, think about this. We need cars on the grid. Now, sure, some people will want to keep their car even if it never, ever runs. Maybe um, it'll be passed down to their kids. I understand that. There's some sentimental value. I've got sentimental value from my 180. Um, you know, it's, I've done a lot with it. But if you, if you don't think you're going to run it and you're not really attached to it, even if you don't need the money, maybe, maybe you're someone that has lots of money and you just don't have the time. Um, but you're not probably planning on coming back. Maybe your license has lapsed. Um, sell that car. Let me know. I'll post it up for you. If you don't want to post it up, a lot of people don't like posting up ads and stuff like that, but we need cars on the grid and we need them now. Um, we had, uh, 18 cars for nationals at round one and that dropped down over the weekend. This weekend at Winton, we've only got 10 entered at Victoria. The, the grids, this has happened on and off over the course of the, the you know the series it's not the end of the world as such with sports sedans it's the ebb and the flow of the class but we need cars on the grid um and if you've got one and you're not going to race it and it's not like your firstborn or your child sell it that's that's the simple thing sell your sports sedan if you're not going to race it so someone else can because there's not many around at the moment um yeah like get motivated get it out there there's um, either contact, you know, if you're in New South Wales, contact the New South Wales Club, Victoria, you can contact Victoria Club, Nationals, you can cl contact Robo John, or you can contact me. Um, we'll get your ads up. We'll get, we know people looking for cars, um, you know, for a fair price. Uh, people pay all right money for the right car. Um, but yeah, let's get, let's make this a push. We're trying to make sports sedans great again. It was great. It still is great, let's be honest. But it's a good catchphrase, isn't it? So we want to get sports sedans out of the garages, onto the grid right now. Not tomorrow, not next year, now. So, um, yeah, hit us up. Let's get them going. Let's get 20 to 30 cars on a grid. Let's get the Nationals having 20 awesome cars every single round. Um, and let's really show everybody why this is actually... Uh, probably one of the best classes in Australia and it's one of the coolest classes in the world um, that hasn't sort of been overtaken by ridiculous aero and, and technology. While we still have some aero and technology in our cars, there is sort of that route, um, you know, built in a garage, putting them, chucking a big motor in the middle of it and trying to get, you know, 9,000 horsepower, no, 800 horsepower and getting lots of power, big tyres, pretty big wings. Um, you know, it's not, it's not ridiculous. It hasn't gone insane as far as all that, you know, you could still build a car in your garage if you have half an idea. So yeah, sports sedans on the track, not in the freaking garage, sell them, give them to someone that can run them, whatever you need to do or finish it yourself and race. We want you. you don't have to sell your car. I'd rather you race it. So, um, you know, if you need a hand, let people know there's, we all want cars on the grid. So yeah. Make sports and ends. Awesome. Cheers, guys.